I'm going to make this quick this year. I'm raising money for Johns Hopkins Children's Center because they saved my oldest daughter's life twice. And my youngest children were in a NICU in a hospital that's affiliated with Johns Hopkins. So any amount of money that you can help me raise really means so much to me because it really, my daughters would not be here and my son would not be here without Johns Hopkins Children's Center. So um, you'll find links below. And um, thank you so much for watching. Goodbye. It's time for the 25th anniversary Civ Extravaganza. Hey guys, how's it going? It's time for yet another game of Civ 3 as part of the 25th anniversary Civ Extravaganza. Um, continues to be absolutely no chance in hell that I'm going to actually uh, finish this or any of the other games I need to finish before um, before Civ 6 comes out, but I think I've, uh, let's see, it's antagonized, uh, sorry, we'll get out of your territory, peace. Um, let's see here. They can't use that hill. I'm pretty sure they can't use that hill. Alright. But they do have a bunch of hills over here they can use. Let's do that. Um, so as of now, I think my strategy is going to be to... Um, when... And I think I might have said this last time. I'm not sure. But when, when uh, Civ 6 comes out, I'm going to... Uh, Who is pink? I don't remember who pink is. Um, I'll play the Aztecs because I did pre-order. Um, I didn't pre-order to get the Aztecs. I pre-ordered because I love playing Civ, and I know that I'm, you know, I want to play that game when it first comes out. Um, but anyway, you know, since I did pre-order and I have the Aztecs until. Uh, as a, like an exclusive until um, January or something. Might as well play the Aztecs first. So that's what I'm planning on doing. And then um, I'll, I'll wrap up this game in the background and I'll uh, move on to 4 and 5 and when I get to 6 again I'll play the Chinese. That's my strategy for now. Mother F and Hastings, man. So much disease. Let's clear some of this crap over here. So it looks like uh, the Mayans have been cultured up like crazy. Because they don't have too many cities, but they've got a ton of land. Alright, we've got a marketplace. Alright, let's continue building roads and whatnot. It's funny how they go back and forth on this so much. So, like, in Civ. Um, five. Um, only one dude can build a road at once. In Civ 1, 2, and 3, you can stack your builders or workers to build roads faster. And then in, um, in Civ 6, now everything you build happens immediately. So. It's interesting how their balance, uh, their their um, game balancing changes uh, as they go back and forth. Oh, um, I'm not sure when uh, when I'm gonna end up uh, posting this, but uh, I was really psyched to uh, to find out that someone's actually using my um, extra life um, donation tracker. So, um, little background. Um, 
um, right now I'm playing this on Windows, um, Civ 3 I'm playing on Windows, and uh, on Windows I use this um, donation tracker um, made by this guy whose um, name on the forums is like BF Finley or B Finley, something like that. Um, and he made this donation tracker using Adobe, uh, I forgot what it's called, but it's some Adobe thing that was supposed to allow for cross-platform um, GUIs. And um, originally the uh, the Twitter, uh, uh, I forgot, there was some Twitter um, program that everyone used to use uh, until Twitter bought them. And they were originally written in that Adobe thing, and so I could use it on Linux, I could use it on Mac, I could use it on Windows, but then Adobe discontinued support for that on Linux, so it stopped being um, so useful as a cross-platform thing. So last year, uh, for whenever I play on Linux, I created a similar program. That it provides all the stuff up there, the how much I raised, my goal, all that stuff. Um, and so, uh, being a good little open source guy, I, uh, I put my stuff up on, uh, GitHub and didn't know if anyone was actually using it, uh, until, um, oh, territory map, okay, for, they want 10 gold. Do you have technology? You have banking. Do I have technology? No. They'll probably be insulted by this deal. What if I throw in spices? And... Uh... The world map? Well, screw you, dude. Territory for territory. Nah, dude. I know where you are. Marketplace. Okay. Granary. Anyway, so then um, somebody uh, did a uh, bug report, or an uh, issue, as they're called in GitHub. And, uh... So I knew someone was using it because someone's asking for features, and that's really cool. And that got me jazzed up, and I started working on it again. Uh, I forgot what Canton was supposed to do. Let me see here. Where's my? Definitely not a fan of the uh, display capture versus the game capture because you get all these stupid pop ups. But for Civ 3, this seemed to be the only way I could get it to work. Alright. Canton is supposed to be a wonder city. But there's no, there are no wonders to build, so. gives you uh, happiness. Library. Let's do library because, oops, I did not want that to happen. Nope. Um, so I have to keep lowering my I had to keep lowering my research for money reasons. It's pretty low at the moment. Alright, let's make some more mines and whatnot. Alright, mine over there. Let's 
Let's get rid of these woods. I think I can make this interrogation. Ooh, trebuchet. Look at that guy pushing that trebuchet. <laughs> from maybe the other continent? That this isn't the Aztec capital either. Where are these guys from? Mother effers just settling everywhere. Oh well. Let's see here. Pink, huh? Alright, maybe it is worth trading a map with pink. Who's pink? The Incas, I think. Let's try the Aztecs first. Aztecs. We'd like to propose a deal. Territory map. What would you want for a territory map? You want world map. They have the medieval infantry. Hmm. Okay. So they're on the other continent. They look pretty big. Okay. The Incas. Territory map. For world map. Accept your offer. Peace. Yeah, so they're all, they're both on the other continent. So I would be wiser to attack the Mayans. Oops. Alright, I'm going to go. Let's see. First of all, let me check military. Uh, the Mayans. They're in anarchy. Nice. We have strong military. Okay. Cool. Let us go over here. And after I set all this up, I need to go make the milk for the kid, or warm up the milk for the kids, and that'll be the end of this playthrough for today. Where the heck is that dude going? You. Over here, dude. Save. And 
that's it. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, be sure to click the subscribe button. I also enjoy comments, so feel free to leave one below. I have a pretty eclectic channel, so here on the right you'll see a selection of other videos you might enjoy.